If you're managing many ULXD6 boundary or ULXD8 gooseneck microphones, Sure networked charging stations are great for monitoring, storage, and charging. Three different sizes accommodate up to two, four, or eight transmitters using Sure rechargeable batteries. You can also use charging stations and Shure wireless workbench software to make changes to transmitter settings, which saves time compared to configuring each transmitter individually. In this video, we'll show you the basics of monitoring transmitters on the charger and adjusting settings using wireless workbench. We'll use an SBC450 networked charging station, a ULXD6 boundary mic, a ULXD8 gooseneck mic, and wireless workbench. To get started, download and install wireless workbench from our website. Once installed, use an Ethernet cable to connect your charging station to the same network as your computer running workbench. You can make sure workbench is using the correct network by going to Tools, Preferences, Network. Next, Find your charging station in the inventory list. To make sure you're looking at the correct charging station, right-click and select Flash to flash the LED lights. When a transmitter is on the charging station, you can also press and hold its mute button to identify it in Workbench's inventory list. Right-click the charging station and choose Properties to see more information about the charger. We have two transmitters docked on the charger right now. For any transmitter, you can monitor its charging level, battery health, the number of charge cycles, and battery temperature. Clicking the gear icon displays network settings, MAC address, and firmware version. You can also restore factory settings for the charging station. To adjust transmitter settings, click on a transmitter. The Item Properties panel shows current settings and lets you make changes to that transmitter. As an example, let's change the LED behavior for this ULXD6. First I'll select it, and then change the mute button's pattern from green and red to red and flashing red. Click Apply, and then we can see that the transmitter reflects the change. You can also select multiple transmitters at once by holding Control or Command. For more information about networked charging stations, visit our website. 